are going to see about biochemical composition and nutritional values of fishes. Fish is considered as a rich source of easily digestible protein, unsaturated fatty acids, essential amino acids, minerals and trace elements of fish have functional effects on human health. The major constituent amino acids are responsible for the synthesis of most body tissues, enzymes, hormones and other metabolic molecules. Feeding habit, sex, species, seasonal and temporal variations and other climatic factors greatly influence the nutritional composition of individual fish species. Constituents in the edible portion of fish are water, protein, lipid, and ash. The analysis of these four basic constituents of fish muscle is often referred as proximate analysis. The range values for these constituents in the edible portion of common fish species are water 65 to 90 percentage, protein 10 to 22 percentage, fat 1 to 20 percentage, mineral 0.5 to 5 percentage, carbohydrates, vitamins, enzymes, nucleotides, other non-protein nitrogenous components, etc. are also present in small quantities. Though quantitatively minor components, these play vital roles in maintaining the system and thus are essential for growth and development of the organisms. Water is essential for all living systems. Body fluids act as medium of transport of nutrients, metabolites, etc. And water is the major component in these fluids. It is required for the normal function of many biological molecules. Water is present in two forms in the tissues, bound to the proteins and in the free form. These forms have well-defined biological roles. Protein. Fish is an excellent source of protein due to its quality and quantity. They contain around 20% of protein. The biological value of fish protein is 80%. Fish is rich in lysine and methionine, hence it has supplementary value with cereals and pulses. Chains of chemical units linked together to make a long molecule. Each unit is made up of 20 amino acids. Is essential in human diet for maintenance of good health. Lysine and methionine are found in high concentrations in fish proteins. 50 to 60 percentage of weight of fish is skeletal protein. Protein content of the fish is classified into three different groups such as albumin, protein and stroma with 16.22%, 75% and 3% respectively. Protein in two components. Other than proteinaceous components, there are few non-proteinaceous components such as peptides, free amino acids, ammonia, trimethylamines, creatine, taurine, betaine, histamine, glycine, uric acid, carnosine, and nucleic acids. Lipids include a wide heterogeneous group of compounds. The important type of compounds included in this group are fatty acids, glycerides, aliphatic alcohols, and waxes. Steroids and a combination of the above type of compounds with proteins, peptides, carbohydrates, etc. In case of fish tissues, the major components of lipids are triglycerol and phosphoglycerides, both containing long chain fatty acids. Smaller proportions of other components are also present. Variations in the lipid content are much wider than that in protein. Fish with fat content as low as 
0.5% and as high as 16 to 18% out of common accounts. If the fat is less than 8%, that fish is classified as oily or fat fish. In animals, energy is stored mainly as fat. When excess energy is available from food, it is stored as fat and it is utilized during periods of low energy availability. This is true in the case of fish also. The storage sites for fat, that is fat depart, are different from different species. In some cases, it is the liver and in some cases, it is the adipose tissue. In a great majority of cases, the depart fat is nearly triglycerol. The brain shows highest concentration of fat, whereas heart shows the lowest. Since the fat content determines the quality of fish, their prices are allotted accordingly. Fatty acids are in the form of monocarboxylic straight chains having even number of carbon atoms which ranges from 12 to 28 atoms. In glyceride group of fatty acids contains three OH groups of glycerol molecule. Fish oil. Fish oil can be obtained by eating fish or taking supplements. Certain fish oil is used as prescription medicine to lower triglycerides levels. Fish oil is most often used in supplements for conditions related to the heart and blood system. A lot of the benefit of fish oil seems to come from the omega-3 fatty acids that it contains. Several different omega-3s exist. Omega-3 fatty acids have carbon chains ranging from 18 to 22 carbon atoms. Depending on the type of fish oil, with a double bond located at the third carbon atom from the end of the carbon chain. EPA has a 20 atom carbon chain. DHA has a 22 atom carbon chain. Linolenic acid has 18 atom carbon chain, which are polyunsaturated fatty acids. Megan fish oil contains carbon-18, carbon-20, and carbon-22 atoms. Polymetallic acid has 16 atom carbon chain, which is a monounsaturated fatty acids. Freshwater fish oil contains larger quantities of C16 and C18, but loss of C20 and C22. Minerals. Mineral is a chemical element required as an essential nutrient by organisms to perform functions necessary for life. Minerals help our bodies develop and function. They are essential for good health. 1 to 2 percentage of fish flesh contains minerals. They are concentrated in fish bones. Of all 90 Naturally occurring inorganic elements, 29 are considered to be essential for all formed animals, including fish. Dietary requirements are established for macro minerals such as calcium, potassium, magnesium, sodium, phosphorus, and sulfur. Micro minerals, that is, trace elements such as copper, ferrous, iodine, manganese, selenium, zinc for one or more fish species. Vitamins. A vitamin is an organic molecule that is essential micronutrient which an organism needs in small quantities for the proper functioning of its metabolism. There are different types of vitamins that help the body in many different ways. Seafood is a great source of vitamins A, D, E and the B vitamins. 
oily fish is a better source of fat soluble vitamins A, D and E and it is also the best natural source of vitamin D which is not found in many fruits. Fish liver is rich in B12 and B complex, vitamin A and D. Inner organs of the fish body is rich in A and D. Liver, eyes, skin, kidney, spleen and intestines and rows of fish are rich in vitamin B. Eels and mackerels are rich in vitamin A and vitamin D respectively. Value of raw fish. When we see about the nutritional value of raw fishes, the nutritional value of fish meal is greater than that of meat of cattle. They are excellent sources of all essential amino acids that are needed in diet. When we take 300 grams of fish, it contains 1 by 2 of total protein and fat and 1 by 4 of calories that are needed in a balanced daily diet that also contains 50% of phosphorus, 30% of iron, 100% of vitamin A, 30% of vitamin B1 and 50 to 100% of eosin. Thank you.